Hi guys, welcome to my video. Today we're talking about the Karcher Puzzy 100 commercial carpet cleaner. As you can see from the attachments here, we have a two and a half meter hose, a small hand lance, which is trigger operated for the one bar nozzle. These attach very simply. They push onto this section here and then it's a quick water attachment, a clip, just like a garden hose really. We also have a long lance, again with a trigger operated nozzle, which is at the base. And if we move over to the machine, we have a button for the vacuum, a button for the water. At the rear of the machine, this is where you put your water and your detergent, which goes through the filter here. You have a maximum level marker here. The water goes through the machine into the carpet and collects at the front, which has a nine liter bucket which is easily removed. And there's also a filter, which is for the vacuum side of things. Let's back again. Other features include caster wheels, which make the machine very easily removable. And the handle on the top, you can place the lance for storage. Right, well let's throw all these bits together and we can see the beast in action. When you're filling the machine, use the front bucket. I tend to use actual Karcher RM760, which is the recommended detergent for the machine. All you need is one scoop, which works out about 100 grams, into hot water. Nice mess just made on the blinds there, excellent. Let that fill up completely, and then pour that into the rear of the machine, where I showed you before. Okay guys, the machine is full, ready to rock. I've got the long lance on and the hose attached. Now we're going to clean this area here. Now you wouldn't believe that this was actually cleaned two weeks ago, but we have a dog, a little eight month old Border Collie, and he tends to bring in the countryside when he comes in with him, so he makes a right old state. But we'll give us a well, and I guarantee this will come up a treat. Now the trick here is and you push forward to actually dispense the detergent through the nozzle at the end and you collect when you draw back the lance towards yourself. It's not recommended that you actually sort of rub and put a little pressure on the, the front collector there. Here we go. This was a minute of cleaning, and that's brought it up really, really nicely. If we look around the perimeter, where I haven't done, you can see the old mud marks, and that's clean as a whistle. If we take a look at the front of the machine here, look at all that crap in there that's come out. And I say that literally was just a minute of cleaning. It really is an efficient machine. Okey we've finally finished cleaning the carpet for the second time after this young man decided to bring some mud in. Just want to show you how I store the, the Puzzy 100 with the hose in the front there, the, the top of the front bucket and the electricity cords in the rear as well and I also bung in the hand lance in the front and then 
and just put it under the stairs where it where it sits nicely. The the carpet itself is a little damped touch, but within the within the hour that sh that should be fully dry. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you want to find out more information, check out the links below. Thanks for watching and take it easy.